Hi, I'm Chef Aaron Sanchez, and welcome to Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge Finale, where the finalists of our recipe contest are competing today using Cacique's authentic Hispanic cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Our panel of judges will decide who will win a culinary week in Napa Valley. My name is Helena Gisi, and today I am preparing my cactus frittata. The biggest challenge to make this dish will be to balance the saltiness and the spiciness in the frittata. I wouldn't have come here if I didn't think I could win, but the other finalists are terrific cooks too. I see that you're using authentic ingredients like cactus and cotija cheese. Absolutely, it makes a big difference. I really like how she's using the cotija. It really adds a lot of texture and volume to that dish. A nice dimension to it, right? I love the cacique cotija cheese. It's such a wonderful, robust flavor and it's so crumbly, the texture is wonderful. Keep watching this channel to see what our next contestant will be cooking up in the Cacique Go Authentico Challenge. Hi, I'm Chef Aaron Sanchez, and welcome to Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge Finale, where the finalists of our recipe contest are competing today using Cacique's authentic Hispanic cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Our panel of judges will decide who will win a culinary week in Napa Valley. My name is Sue Tenpass, and today I'm preparing roast squash and pear soup with chorizo meatballs. The most challenging part of this dish is getting the meatballs right. It's a challenge to make sure they stay moist and don't get overcooked. A quick question, are you gonna put those chorizo meatballs in your soup? I am, Chef. I love using Cacique products because they're fresh and authentic. I particularly love the crema mexicana. It has a wonderful buttery richness and sweetness, so it's a lively counterbalance to spicy foods. Interesting idea with the chorizo. Keep watching this channel to see what our next contestant will be cooking up in the Cacique Go Authentico Challenge. Hi, I'm Chef Aaron Sanchez, and welcome to Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge Finale, where the finalists of our recipe contest are competing today using Cacique's authentic Hispanic cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Our panel of judges will decide who will win a culinary week in Napa Valley. My name is Helena Gisi, and today I am preparing my cactus frittata. The biggest challenge to make this dish will be to balance the saltiness and the spiciness in the frittata. I wouldn't have come here if I didn't think I could win, but the other finalists are terrific cooks too. I see that you're using authentic ingredients like cactus and cotija cheese. Absolutely, it makes a big difference. I really like how she's using the cotija. It really adds a lot of texture and volume to that dish. A nice dimension to it, right? I love the cacique cotija cheese. It's such a wonderful, robust flavor. And it's so crumbly, the texture is wonderful. Keep watching this channel to see what our next contestant will be cooking up in the Cacique Go Authentico Challenge. Hi, I'm Chef Aaron Sanchez, and welcome to Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge Finale, where the finalists of our recipe contest are competing today using Cacique's authentic Hispanic cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Our panel of judges will decide who will win a culinary week in Napa Valley. My name is Leah Lyon, and today I'll be preparing shrimp rajas al carbon panela tostaditos. In my kitchen, it's very important to use authentic Hispanic ingredients like cacique. Cacique helps me keep it real. My biggest challenge with this dish is making sure that I slice the cheese properly. I slice it into rounds instead of into wedges. Getting them evenly so that I don't break them is the biggest challenge. You're using panela as a tostada? Oh, just wait till you try it. You're going to love it. I love how they're using the products. Yeah, me too. They're doing a great job. Keep watching this channel to see what our next contestant will be cooking up in the Cacique Go Authentico Challenge. Hi, I'm Chef Aaron Sanchez, and welcome to Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge Finale, where the finalists of our recipe contest are competing today using Cacique's authentic Hispanic cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Our panel of judges will decide who will win a culinary week in Napa Valley. My name is Stella Ortega, and I'll be preparing chicken a la Diablo today. I think my biggest challenge today in my dish is uh, the spiciness to balance that out. Oh, it looks like you might have added a lot of chiles to your sauce there. Yes, I did, but the crema mexicana is going to balance it out perfectly. I first discovered Cacique products when I was a young girl. I mean, it's part of our life. I love the bold Mexican flavor of Cacique chorizo. It blends perfectly 
with my chicken and adds the right spiciness to my red chili sauce. But it's interesting that none of them used any herbs. No. They have better knife skills than I do. <laughs> Keep watching this channel to see which finalist will be declared the winner of the Cacique Go Authentico Challenge. Welcome to the finale of Cacique's Go Authentico Challenge, where the finalists of our recipe contest just finished preparing their dishes using authentic Hispanic Cacique cheeses, creams, and chorizo. Let's see who won that trip to Napa Valley. Sue, I really enjoyed the pear flavor profile to your soup. However, it really overpowered the chorizo meatballs. Stella, that was a great traditional dish. Loved the sauce, but the chicken wasn't very tender. Thank you. Helena, great dish. I would have it for breakfast, lunch, or dinner, but it needs some herbs. Leah, that was one of the most creative usages of panela cheese I've ever seen. But it was too salty. However, you are the winner. <laughs> yeah! Cacique has been the authentic Hispanic cheese of choice in the U.S. for nearly four decades. Cacique, go authentico.